Hello guys, I am Shahzad from Shakzi.com and uh, welcome in Source Tree and uh, GitHub and also the Bitbucket series. We have already created a lecture available on the YouTube uh, for the Bitbucket. Now, uh, how can you clone your repository by using the Source Tree? So first of all, you need a, a, a repository. So I am using the Bitbucket for now. So how you have to log in with your account. So first of all, go to the bitbucket.org and log in with your account. Once you log in, just click on the plus button and go to the repository. And now I'm going to create my own repository. I'm saying XYZ. So they can see this is the XYZ repository. I'm saying this is the private repository. You can also uh, uncheck this one. Click on this one if you want to add some read me script you can also select from here i'm not going to select okay now i'm saying uh, that allow only private forks okay no forks you can select any options from here so i'm saying the language is php let's suppose because the i'm going to upload the files of the php in this repository so click on the create repository button so now as you can see we have just created a repository named x y z so now as you can see this is the x y z repository as you can see it's saying get your local git repository on bitbucket okay or it's saying connect your existing repository to bitbucket what you need just need to copy this bad boy okay now i'm going to open the source tree software i have already downloaded and installed the software in my previous lectures if you are not familiar with the source tree just go to our previous lectures and watch that particular lectures okay now i am saying this is the source tree by bitbucket or okay fine now as you can see uh, if you click on the plus button i am saying clone okay uh, okay now go to the local and or click on the remote so you can see this is the bitbucket i have bitbucket account so that's why it's showing me three repository so uh, this is the xyz repository we have just created now what you just need to click on the clone button so it's automatically getting the repository from the uh, here bitbucket and now what you just need to provide the local repository and now i'm going to because i'm using the xam uh, available in my x c drive so ht docs and now here i'm creating a new folder i'm saying xyz so as you can see i have just created the xyz just double click this bad boy and now go to the source tree select your bad boy which you have just created i'm saying xam htdocs and xyz folder so this is the xyz folder xyz folder. so this is the folder i'm saying select folder so now as you can see i have just selected the folder if you have installed any server at anywhere what you need just need to select your server from here you, uh, you can also click on the advanced setting and set something uh, some other settings here now i am saying just clone Okay, now as you can see, I have just cloned the repository from the Bitbucket to my local environment by using the source tree. Now I'm going to add some files here. Let's suppose I'm going to use, wait for a few seconds, I'm going to, okay, it's a CI fast. I'm going to copy all these things from here and I'm going to paste all this, these things at here xyz which we have just created make sure this is the xyz folder and it's a local environment once we copied okay now we have successfully copied so these are the files we have just copied now go to the source tree so wait for a few seconds so now as you can see your source tree uh, collected or fetched all the files from your local environment now you have to push these files to your git repository or here bitbucket so now if you click on this bitbucket and if you click on this xyz so as you can see it's showing you 
something like that now if i click on the stage all so these are your local files that means you are going to push all your files from local environment to your git repository or to bitbucket now you have to add the comment let's suppose um, coding nighter coding nighter fast environment or something like oh i'm saying coding nighter fast course okay now what you need just need to click on the comment button now you have successfully uploaded your files from your local environment to your uh, git repository which is the bitbucket you can clone the repository uh, from the bitbucket to your local environment by using the source tree if you have any questions uh, let me know in the descriptions below or please leave a comment in the video if you think we are doing good feel free to share our courses and also the videos and don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you never miss any updates so thank you for watching